Welcome to Homebrew Wednesday on Thanksgiving Thursday. It is quarter to eight in the morning. Having a cup of Dunkin' Donuts pumpkin spice coffee. Fixing turkey. And we'll have stuffing and we'll have uh, a pie. What else do we have? Corn. A salad, cauliflower salad, several other things. But anyway, uh, since I got, I am late putting the Humber Wednesday up, I'm going to go ahead and post it probably today since while the turkey's cooking, I'm not going to have a whole lot to do. I may film some little clips and jump some stuff in there about my cooking while we're doing this, just for entertainment value. So anyway, stay tuned, watch the video, and happy Thanksgiving to everyone.
I've been taking samples of this every night. This is the uh, Ancho Coco Porter beer. And as you saw earlier in the video, I put the bag of the Ancho Chili Peppers down inside of here. So basically what I've been doing is trying to take a sample of this and stuff so when it gets hot enough and stuff with enough heat, I keep saying it and stuff a lot, don't I? Maybe I have to try to correct that. Uh, when it gets warm enough, heat-wise, as far as like the pepper flavor and everything's concerned, I'm gonna pull these out. Now, last night it got was getting to the point and stuff that I was really starting to taste the pepper, and not so much of the cocoa or the chocolate or anything because I did forget to put the cocoa powder in there towards the end of the boil, like I said I was going to. So all it basically has in here is the chocolate malt. So what I did since I want some more chocolate flavor in this than what it has right now. I actually ordered some cocoa nibs or cacao nibs or queso nibs or I really don't know how to pronounce it. So I always kind of stir this up because I figure all the pepper is probably right in the middle of this where I really can't get an accurate reading. And I just got a little sample cup here. And then I'll fill that up. It's really hard to tell where I'm at on this camera. I just got a wine thief here, which these things are really, really handy. I noticed that uh, 
In terms of creative kid actually uses his when he takes his hydrometer samples so he doesn't have to waste all that wort. So anyway, so I ordered, like I said, the cocoa nibs, so we'll find out what this tastes like, like heat-wise. So here's my little sample. Let me turn it this way a little bit. My nasty, filthy garage. My taxidermy business this year. And get squat. So anyway, this really doesn't have a lot of peppery smell or anything like that to this. I mean, you smell kind of the smoke and stuff, and I think that's mostly from the malt, not so much from the uh, ancho peppers. But it's not got a whole lot. Of course, in this little tiny glass and stuff, it's kind of hard to tell. But I mostly smell smoke. peppers really coming through. So like I said, it's not got to the point where it's really hot or anything. Because I actually wanted a little bit of heat in here. I realize with the end shows that I, I'm not going to get a whole lot of heat. But the strange thing about these pepper beers, and I actually have one that a uh, guy sent me, is that you don't get the heat up at the front of your mouth. It's like at the very back of your tongue down your throat. But, uh, I think it could probably go a couple more days. So like I said, I ordered the cocoa nibs and I'm going to go ahead and put those in here and let them soak as well because I want more chocolate flavor to go with this. And so like I said, there's not a lot of heat there or anything yet, so I'm gonna go ahead and let this sit. So, anyway. So like I said, I've already racked it off the secondary, so most of the yeast sediment is gone. There's a small layer of them. So anyway, I think that's going to wrap up my Homebrew Wednesday video. Hopefully I'll get it posted Thursday. I still have to edit it. I haven't put it all together because I was going to throw the Thanksgiving Day footage in there and I may, I may not. I don't know. You probably don't want to see me cook. But there's a little pepper flavor there, but I'm going to go ahead and leave it. So anyway, cheers, 17. Happy Homebrew Wednesday. I hope this get this posted by Thursday. If not, it's going to be Friday morning, folks. So anyway. You have a good weekend. Nice long weekend. So, see y'all later. Hey, Mr. Bob, but I found it. <laughs> that just don't look right. Okay, I've been taking. Well, let's just have a little. All right. I'm still not on there. Let's try this again. There we go. Maybe. Okay. 